mm -hmm. Katie? And it's going to be cold enough once again to continue to make snow up at A Basin here across the Denver area. We're expecting a low of 40, so still a pretty chilly start to our morning. Very seasonal for this time of the year. By 7 o'clock, we'll be at 44 degrees, 9, still pretty cool out there. Definitely want a sweatshirt, a light jacket early on. 51 degrees by then. Clearing skies through mid-morning and we're expecting plenty of sunshine. Dry conditions all across the state for tomorrow and temperatures a tad bit warmer than what we experienced today. This morning we started off at 40 degrees under a cloudy sky. Some damp conditions early on but our highs reached the mid 60s. That's about 6 degrees shy of our typical seasonal normal. Downtown right now we're at 53 degrees. Winds relatively calm from the east northeast out of the airport as well where temperatures are in the mid 40s. So if you're out and about early tomorrow morning, our temperatures will gradually climb to the upper 60s, uh, rather the upper 40s for tomorrow. But highs this afternoon topped out at 65 degrees. It was 70 down the springs and another clear and breezy day into the high country. Fire danger won't be as high for tomorrow. Temperatures currently in the 30s and 40s from Steamboat down through Gunnison, Leadville at a cold 28 degrees and then in Denver and the northeastern plains seeing 40s at this hour. So in terms of our satellite and radar outside, not too much going on across the state. That very strong cold front exited this afternoon, but a frost advisory. That's our main weather story for the northeastern corner of Colorado through early tomorrow morning. Temperatures will hover near freezing to the upper 30s. This includes Greeley, Fort Collins, down through Castle Rock and up through Holyoke, Julesburg and Lyman. So if you have any sensitive plants outside now, be a really good time to bring them in, especially with those cold conditions expected. Air quality warning will still be in place until early tomorrow morning where the Decker fire is. That includes Chafee and Fremont counties near Canada. Canyon City and Salida. Taking us through our future cast for early tomorrow morning by 430 will be in the upper 40s with a couple of showers expected down south of the springs and even some low clouds and areas of fog further north into Fort Collins, Greeley by 930. Clear skies in Denver and west into the mountains. Across the state for tomorrow afternoon, winds will kick up once again across eastern Colorado, but overall temperatures pretty seasonal for this time of the year. Lows will cool to the upper 30s to low 40s across a big chunk of the front range and plains. Some 20s and even upper teens expected at our highest elevations into the mountains. Then tomorrow afternoon, pretty seasonal. 69 degrees expected out at DIA 70 downtown, upper 60s into Fort Collins, Greeley and Loveland. 40 for a low tonight. Sunrise tomorrow will be at 656 and we're expecting sunshine through the afternoon in pretty comfortable conditions. A high of 69 with wind sustained from the west at 5 to 10 miles per hour. By Friday, a much warmer afternoon. We're back to near 80 degrees here across the metro area with overnight lows still hovering in the 40s. Not expecting any freezing conditions on the seven day forecast. Saturday, dry, clear, 70 degrees, a nice weekend overall. Very quiet into the high country as well and we'll stay in the 70s for highs through early next week.